the number of deaths from novel coronavirus exceeded 1 million worldwide this morning Beijing time. China is the only country with a large population to effectively contain this horrible pandemic. China shouldn't flaunt it, but to belittle this achievement, find fault in it and see that it reflects many bad things in China, is a more unhealthy attitude than showing off. In the fight against the pandemic so far, it has become very clear who our enemies are, as the need for global cooperation. But such global efforts are still a mess. Political disputes are obviously more powerful than technical cooperation. This undoubtedly has led to more infections and deaths every day. Although there are still territorial disputes in the world, the impulse for the countries to expand territories has greatly reduced. Traditional geopolitical struggles are bound to drift away from common people's interests, and the common challenges of the mankind are gradually coming to the forefront. Whoever looks to divide the world now will go down in infamy in history. The Trump administration has done little to fight the pandemic in the US, and it has divided the world at the peak of the pandemic. All this will surely be a big stain on his administration.